All right, guys, Flay from Boxing Evolution TV, and I'm joined here by Adam Scott, who is the founder of a revolutionary new smell-destroying system, O-Reduce. How are you doing, Adam? Yeah, I'm good, thanks, mate. Good stuff. Well, nice to uh, speak to you. And, uh, well, start from the beginning. What is O-Reduce all about? Well, basically, O-Reduce has come about... Um, <sighs> lots of people suffer with um, build-up of smell in their kit. Basically, it usually comes from sweat. Uh, it's basically ideally for boxing gloves, it can work on standard shoes, anything really that you can't wash or would ruin washing. Um, O-Reduce has been designed to basically help you keep fresh. So our strap line is fresh kit. So effectively it's a, it's a very simple little system. You have a bag and a spray combo. Uh, the bag can be used for everyday gym use. Effectively it's made from a patented mineral compound and what this does is this is, allows odour to be re released from the bag. So even if you've just got your normal kit from training, you keep that in the bag and unlike keeping it in a normal plastic bag or your kit bag, um, usually people do forget about it for a couple of days. What this will do is just on its own, it will prevent the build up of bad odour. So your kit's not going to get washed or any cleaner being in it, but what it will do is it will stop the build up of smell. Then when you combine it with our natural plant extract spray, Effectively, um, you've got two options. You can either keep the kit fresh or you can treat it. So if you've got a pair of smelly boxing gloves just like these ones, um, they don't take long to smell, as I'm sure many boxers will understand. Uh, effectively, the way you do it is quite simply. You take the spray. Now, we recommend that you use three sprays per item. And with boxing gloves as well, they can be particularly difficult to get the spray inside the end of the glove. So you can actually spray a bit of tissue and you put that in the glove end. But quite simply, you would um, spray inside three times. Have a sniff of what it smells like. Oh, it smells just quite minty or mentally. Well, it's, um, it's got, you know, some people say clove, others say, yeah. what, what it's got in it is it's got natural plant extract lemon. So it has got a fair amount of um, bacterial property in it anyway. It is a unique smell, but... Um, Does that smell remain on the, on the gloves or the product after you've deodorized it? So basically what happens is, is um, we recommend you do three sprays per glove, which is what I've just done. You then pop it into our bag. Uh, it's a zip tie bag, so you can seal it up. You pop them in, you see the bag's been designed to hold one pair of gloves, maybe two at a push. Um, you then seal it up and you would leave it in there for three days. That's our recommended. Now I have had people come back to me and say they've kept it in there for longer, but three days is ideal. After three days, basically take the item out. It will smell a little bit like the spray to start with, but that soon dissipates. And then what you find is it's just a fresh smell. There's no real odor to it at all. Um, you can stick your nose in it and you're just, it, it's just fresh. Uh, and effectively, that's the system and how you would treat your gloves. Um, so we'll leave those there for three days and you can uh, test <laughs> right. me out if that yeah, works. Yeah, we'll come back in three days and we'll see how the, uh, the gloves... Now, do these do anything as well, such as help with mould build-up or anything like that? Well, um, effectively, the bag will. So I've spoken to a few gyms and I know where they keep the gloves. Sometimes it can get a bit damp, especially in the winter months. Um, so the bag will actually release moisture and odour, but it won't let any moisture back in. So actually storing a dry set of gloves in here would stop it from getting mouldy. Uh, because it's breathable, one thing it won't do is dry the item. So you will still get a certain build up of condensation within it. So we always recommend that you make your product as dry as possible before you put it in the bag for storage. So say for example, if I've just done, you know, a good boxing workout, you know, hour doing the bag, skipping, sparring, and my gloves are absolutely drenched with sweat. I mean, do, do I want to let them dry off a bit before I put them into the bag, the air reduce thing? Well, if I? you're just going to take them straight home, then I would suggest you can just use the bag for everyday use. Um, but if you're going to store them in there, then yes, ideally you want to let them dry out a little bit. They can be damp, but if they're, um, if they're soaking wet, then you would still, just as you would in a plastic bag, get some condensation build up. Okay. And certainly if you're going to treat them, make sure they're a little bit dry. But, but several boxers that have been using this for a while now, what they'll tend to do is generally about once a month, they'll treat the gloves properly. And then what they'll do is in between using, just after you've used it, instead of storing it in a bag, you just spray inside the glove one or two times to keep it fresh and just put it in your kit bag. I was gonna get onto that. Now, how well does the spray work without the bag? Well, effectively, um, as, a fresh, as, as keeping things fresh, then it works very, very well. I mean, ideally the system is, I mean, because of the mineral compound in the bag, 
effectively it will absorb and push the bad odours out. But it's designed to keep the natural plant extract in. So by using the bag, it's a lot stronger in the way that it works. You're in a confined space, it's sealed, it keeps my spray inside, but it lets out the bad odour, effectively pushing that out. I mean, we tested this on a, um, on a T-shirt that basically got petrol on it. Um, so as a, as a quite an acid test, we thought, well, we'll try it out. So what we did is we, we washed the T-shirt anyway. It's still stained with petrol. We sprayed it, I must admit, a few more than three times. And then we put it inside the bag. And very interestingly, over the first couple of days, it pushed out the smell of petrol. Yeah. To be honest, the room it was in smelled like a garage. <laughs> um, but then after three days, it started to push out the smell of the spray. And once we knew the spray was coming through, we felt that that had actually done its job. And uh, we left it another day or so for good measure. And then when we pulled it out, I won't say it completely eliminated the smell, but it certainly could be worn again and you didn't smell like a, a petrol garage walking around. Yeah. Well, I mean, for, you know, there's one thing combating bacterial smell, there's another thing combating a petrol-based smell. You know, for, for, it, for that to work on a petrol-based smell, you know, even a bit is a good sign. Of, I think. Well, it, it was quite impressive, but yes, this is really truly designed to eliminate the, the odour from sweat. I mean, that's why it, it's pitched to the sporting market. It also works very, very well on, on your, your regular um, steel toe cap shoes, etc. I've got a few mates in building and they use it on their building boots. I have to say it works really well on those as well. And general trainers, um, from my understanding, once you've had your new pair of nights for a while, um, they can start to smell a bit. And uh, this is just designed basically to prolong the life of your equipment. Me, myself, I've often had trainers that I'd throw out before their life was, was over. Um, put them in a washing machine, it tends to ruin them or it starts it on that slope to, to throwing them out. Um, but this effectively just keeps it fresh. So um, for someone who's been using this regularly as a boxer, generally once a month is all you have to treat them. Now the bottle itself is uh, 10.95 retail and the bag is 250. Together we sell them as a system for 12.99. Um, and what that works out is you get around about 30 treatments out of one bottle of spray. So in our estimations, that's around about 40p a treatment. Now, if you just had one pair of gloves or one pair of trainers, effectively you'd be looking at doing it once a month. This could last you up to 30 months. And what it'll do is, is like I say, it will mean that you can actually wear out that 100 pound pair of trainers or that 80 pound pair of boxing gloves until they're genuinely worn and you need to throw them out rather than, my God, they whiff, I'm gonna throw them away. No, I mean, it sounds absolutely awesome. I think it's much needed. And as soon as I heard about this product, I want our team to uh, get helping me get out there because I think it's gonna do really well. And onto that note, for anyone that is interested in buying it, uh, what's your website, Twitter, anything like that? Well, uh, our website is www.ireduce.com. Uh, we do have Facebook and Twitter's on its way. Uh, effectively, you can order online. Um, we've got special offers going on at the moment and there will be a, a, a special code going for Boxing Evolution. That will allow um, all of your contacts and clients to receive a 15% discount from RRP. Um, so please pop on and have a look. Uh, the website's pretty self-explanatory and with every order you would get a mini leaflet that will allow you to just quick instructions on how to use and best practice and then we'd very much appreciate your feedback. And uh, what's the special promo code for my viewers if they want to get reduced? Um, it's BEFRESH01. Be fresh. There you go. <laughs> so, um, so like I say, please log on. That will work. That, that code is designed specifically for the starter kit. So that's the bag and the spray. You get the 15% discount and um, we can then give a bit of feedback to yourself as to, to how many of your followers have, have jumped on board. I'm also going to do a little test run myself. I'm going to film it. I'm going to get my mum to uh, sniff my trainers before I put them in the bag <laughs> and you'll have a good response from that. And then we'll uh, bring them out three days later and we'll uh, see the results. Well, so, uh, please bring it on. Yeah, yeah love a test. <laughs> and also, guys at home, if you want to conduct your own test, you know, he's, he's fully willing for it to be thrown in the deep end, you know, and I believe you've got a money back guarantee. Yes, uh, certainly if the, if the product doesn't work, then please do contact us at feedback at O-Reduce. And uh, yeah, I, I would be very, very shocked if it didn't. But like I say, please don't feel that this is going to cure everything. It is just a system in which you can keep things fresher for longer. Okay, guys, well, this is Adam Scott from O-Reduce. Great doing an interview with you, and I wish you much luck with the product. Thanks. Play from Boxing Evolution TV. Over and out.